What's up YouTube? I have another um, real MMA uh, championship belt. This one is the Predator MMA World Championship. Uh, I believe the yeah, watch away uh, version of it. This was done by Peter Ellis at uh, Leather Rebels. He has the current contract on some of the WWE belts like the NXT belts. But this one is one of his MMA. It is a stack plate. I do believe the main plate is three layers which is the bottom. Uh, the middle layer which is the bigger one all the way around with the wings and then the, the globe is also another attached layer so let's take a look this is dual plated both real nickel and gold plating as you can see it has a little crown on the top with a more plain um, eagle with his wings coming out as you can see Underneath, we do have a cage, like most MMA belts do have that cage. Look behind, and of course, it is a textured nickel texture underneath. The dome globe is, like I said, a separate piece. Um, I did get this belt from from um, Randy at uh, Top Rope Belts. Uh, he did do some modifications. He said he reinforced the globe, the dome globe, and changed some of the Sorosi crystals from clear to red. See, uh, the bottom layer looks like it's about four millimeters, and the top one uh, from here it looks like it's about two. But as you can see how it, it goes from a thin, thin layer to a much more thicker layer around. Uh, both side plates are identical to one another. As you can see, stack plates as well. Same thing, uh, dual plated nickel and gold. Uh, as you can see, the leather. It's textured all the way around. A nice tight cut around. We have two by eight mail snaps. You can see there is if I can get good lighting, it's very cloudy today. There's the leather rebels stamp. Uh, it's not too bright today, it's a very cloudy day. Uh today November first. As you can see, the logo plate, dual plated as well, and also has the logo tip. Same thing, two by five nickel female snaps. Let's go ahead and flip it over. Regular standard black backing, nothing fancy. Yeah, I saw this first when um, Peter posted on his page. Uh, liked it a lot, very nice belt. And then it popped up for sale by a private owner, which I said it was uh, Randy. So we came to a deal, and now it's part of my collection. Very nice belt. It's not as heavy. It has a little weight to it, but it's not as heavy as, say, the uh, probably the heaviest belt I have is my um, the um, Bulldog belt by, by I forgot his name right now. Sorry, it's been a long day. Here we go. Nice. Get plated, stacked. Has a nice curve to it. Alright, so if you have any questions, just go ahead and leave them in the comments. I have posted some, uh, some more pictures on my Instagram page, which is the same name as my YouTube user page. Uh, take a look. I'm going to take a look, check them out. Like I said, any questions just go ahead and just leave them in the message comment section or just pn me all right that's it for now